Okay, think Chuck Norris. Yeah. Ready? And action! Action Master Super Savage! First cut! Cut, cut, cut! So take me away! Okay, guys, so welcome back to this channel, my channel. And thank you all to all the new subscribers, all of you that have been to subscribe with me for quite some time or ever since I started. You guys mean so much to me and I love getting new subscribers. You guys just, you touch me right here. It brings a tear to my eye. I need some tissues. But I could also need some tissues because I'm sick. So, you know, if I sound a little bit off or you hear me sniffle up a little bit, it's because I'm sick, guys. I don't know how I keep getting sick, but this year is just not the year for me. It, I've been sick left and right and I'm just sick of it. No pun intended. But are you guys ready for a kick-ass recommendation for a TV show slash animation cartoon? Chin Chin! Chin Chin! That is right, people. If you have ever seen animation or if you're a big anime person that loves, you know, these little animation cartoons, You've probably seen Jin Jan. And if you don't like Shin Chan after watching it, you are mentally retarded. You know, I'm not gonna say mentally retarded just flat out, but you got a problem with you. Cause this shit right here is the bomb. If I could do the little do the little dude that does the ass dance, he just chicks his butt back and forth. I can't do it. But anyway, the little kid is five years old, he's got a bunch of little five-year-old friends and they're like in a Japanese kindergarten or an American Japanese version of a kindergarten school. Everybody speaks English or, you know, the original show was done in Japanese, but I've always watched it in English. So I'm gonna assume that they did both to suit the needs of people in America or people that speak English, wherever they may be. But guys, the show is basically about a little... Like I said, five-year-old boy, he's got a bunch of little five-year-old friends, uh, Boo, Maso, Shin, Penny, and Georgie. <coughs> Georgie's the clean freak, he talks a lot of politics and, you know, is very forward in his opinion, but has manners. And that's why we only bring it up in election years. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Penny is the aggressive one. Her parents don't really have a good relationship. Her dad's apparently a drunk wife beater. And, uh, yeah, mom just kind of is a sketch from no end. And they both beat on bunnies. And I'm not talking about, like, living bunnies. I'm talking about, like, big oversized stuffed rabbits. They've bought, like, 50 of them. And they kind of just using use them as punching bags. That's when I knew the Chinese boy was right. In a world of globalized exploitation, loss of meaning, and devils named Shin, happiness was simply impossible. No, mommy! Don't do it like Foxy! I promise to take better care of him! Don't take you away! No longer am I the happiness bunny. Now and forever, I'm the bunny of misery and despair. Destroying my fantasy, I'll destroy you! Crim brulee! I'll give you pain brulee! For when they get angry. Not something you want to teach your five-year-old, but it's funny in a cartoon. The little girl's just sucking the fucking rabbit in the face. It's hilarious. Uh, the little boo kid, for some reason, has this weird obsession with trees. He gets offended if you talk bad about his pet rock. And he's always got some kind of booger just hanging off his face. <laughs> in one episode, he just kind of makes the booger go in and out of his nose and out this way and back this way. Why is he just standing there? Maybe he's dead. Wait, look, his nostrils. Action bastard super snot yo-yos. <laughs> That's so wrong. It's original. Um, Shin, he likes to pull down his pants all the time. He does the little ass dance, which I find fucking hysterical. He just makes his little butt cheeks go up and down across the screen and ass dance, ass dance. It's fucking hilarious. I, d I don't have to be drunk or I, I don't have to have something to drink before I watch this. It makes it ten times funnier, 
But that's what makes it so funny, is because I can just laugh at it, you know, just to laugh. Because it's funny. But Shin is a little hellion, and I swear to God, if I ever had a kid like that, he'd be a dead kid. Now, all of you that are sensitive out there and are saying, Oh, she's talking about beating her kids. No, I'm not. The kid torments the hell out of his neighbors, torments the hell out of his parents, and torments his friends. And for some reason, he always likes to be naked or have his ass hanging out. Open up! It's the ass police! Oh, Christ, it's him! Which, in context, is funny. You'd have to see it to know what I was talking about. But that's why I'm recommending it, guys. You should watch it and check it out and then give your opinion on how you feel about it. So, this kid also has crushes on all these women that he just, he can't have. <laughs> Uh, I think one of the ladies' names is Nanako. He calls her Hottie Nanako. It's, he's always flirting and crushing on her, and she's just all, ah, ah. And he's got fantasies of her, and it, they're just, they're hilarious for a little five-year-old kid. <coughs> <coughs> he talks about wieners and dongs and butt cheeks. I was looking forward to that dessert. Um, tell him I'm washing my hair. It does look tasty. Tell him I'm washing my rear. Uh. Damn you, back door! How dare you let that dirty little bastard in! If you swap that dessert with a pile of snot, how long do you think it would take for people to notice? And, you know, his mom's tiny boobs and her boob jar that she saved money for so she could get bigger boobs. Talks about how big her ass is and how much she could kill people with it. His little sister, who's a baby, Hema, loves his little friend Georgie. She's just always into the guys, and she's a baby. It's, it's hilarious how she does it. But instead of telling you guys the whole storyline of the show itself, you, my friends, will have to go and check it out because I, it's not really anything else I can tell you other than it's bomb as fuck. If you don't believe me, take my advice and check it out. Like I said, you can watch the videos on YouTube for free or you can look them up, they probably have them somewhere else free, or you can go ahead and just buy the DVDs. Or if you've already watched it, drop me a comment. Let me know how you like it, how you enjoy it, what you think about it. Um, any episodes that I might have missed, or anything that I missed in talking about here. I mean, I've just been binge-watching this shit pretty much all day, so <laughs> let me know! That's pretty much all I have for today, guys. That is it. That is my recommendation from me to you on a show or a TV series that was a TV series and no longer is a TV series that you could possibly enjoy or maybe somebody that likes anime or whatever the hell they want to call it could enjoy. So take that knowledge and go forth with it. If you're looking for a new cartoon adult TV show, this is it. Right here. I got one right here for you. Just... Test it out and let me know what you think. Because I can't help you other than that. I will have some either in the beginning or the end of this video inserted of just a couple clips from some of the Shin Chan episodes that kind of just shows you what I was talking about so I don't look like a crazy imbecile just sitting here jumping around about a TV show. And talking about some little kid showing his ding dong. Um, will you buy me a shotgun, Dad? Sorry, I'm broke. But I've got an idea for me and you. <gasps> Just imagine this, a weekly allowance for you and a moderate raise in allowance for your old man. With your cutes and my brains, we'll be unstoppable. At last, the men in this family will be wearing the balls. Can't you just see it, Shin? Yes, we'll be mightier than action bastard. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, let's do it. But you can't double-cross me. Huh? Of course not. Then let's do the trust dance of the manly brotherhood of men! Huh? To be a man, you must have honor, honor, and a penis! Oh, yeah. mm, do I really have to? Yeah, you do, if you have any hope of me teaming up with you. Fine, let's do it. Better not half-ass it, old man. One, One two, two, three. three. To, to be, be a man, man you must have honor, honor, and a penis! <laughs> Just by the way, it's in, so we can cover it now, the, other than the kid showing his butt cheeks, you, you might see some side boob, uh, you, you might see the little kid's 
pecker, but I mean, it's a cartoon, guys, come on. It's a little round thing, and then he's got like a little tic-tac attached to it. So, I mean, you're not really seeing much. <laughs> all right, guys, that is all I have for you today. I hope that you guys enjoyed this, this video. And if you did, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel because that is the only way you will get my new videos. It kind of, you know, gives you a little notification when I put one up so you know that I have one instead of just kind of guessing. Alright guys, so, love you all. I hope that you all are happy and smiling and everything in your life is just fabulous. And I hope it stays that way for you because life can be rough sometimes. I'll see you guys next time. Love you all. Bye.